Well, hello YouTube, I'm back. So, I've been, uh, I've been sick for a week, so sorry I haven't posted nothing or an update or anything, but I just really got back to building the 70 Chevelle. So, I, I, I man, I've been, I had that stomach virus and it lasted about a week. I missed a couple of days of work and, and, uh, it was bad. Now my wife's got it, so <laughs> that sucks too. She's been out of work a couple of days herself. So, um, well, this is where I'm at. I actually uh, cut the doors open like I said I was gonna do. Um, let's see if I can get some light on it. Here. And uh, I used a uh, nylon string, which uh, I, I think I'm gonna use the back of an exacto knife next time I do this. Uh, it, it cut really good, but it when I, I I did use the back of a knife on on cutting the piece out of the interior to put on the back of the door here, and and it worked pretty straight. So um, this is all the I flocked the interior. I had to I had to extend. Uh, this out to fit the body this way but I still got a little bit more flocking to do there's a couple bare spots I, I'm gonna touch it up again um, this is my first time doing the door cut so I'm cutting the door open so uh, next time I, I, I looked on the internet and I, I, next time I want to make the doors open from the inside um, from in here, not the outside, and I found a way of doing that. I wish somebody would post a video on YouTube to do that, but uh, I found it on the web, and now I just gotta find it again. So I mean, I lost it, but I'll, I'll find it, and we'll do the next one. I'm thinking about doing a Camaro that way. I've got a few Camaros in the in the cupboard, so um, I did pick up the '55 Nomad again. I was I've been working on that. I'm fine-tuning it because I chopped the top on it so let me see if it focuses in there you go see I'm, I've got some putty on the um, on the gas cap back there so uh, gonna clean that up and I've been cleaning some of this stuff up in here just making it right and got this all done back here so well, um, I, I like to work on this little by little. I'll probably pick up another project and work on that one at the same time. But uh, it's, I've been watching on YouTube people cutting open doors, and and they say the the biggest thing is uh, the biggest thing is take your time, and I can't emphasize that any. I can't emphasize that enough I mean I, I used a fishing line thinking it was gonna be fast and I shouldn't have done that but I, I, I did snap this down here because it, it, I don't think you know I it didn't cut a straight line and then I had to fill it with putty and working with it so much I snapped this so I had to work with this I had to work with it quite a bit I, I mean, one door I, I did take my time on and it came out pretty pretty decent the other door you know, I thought I, I got a lot of too, uh, I got a little too sure of myself, and that's what happens, I guess. Uh, I'm starting the motor now, you know, I'm starting to paint that. I got some pieces in the box that I've painted too, not really much. Like I said, I've been sick, and <clears throat> it's been one of them weeks. So, uh, uh, this is pretty much. Uh, all I've done, you know, I'm, I told you guys I put up a, a, a YouTube update, and there you go, you know. I, I just want to tell everybody thanks for the the input, you know. Um, uh, I, I like watching you guys' videos, you know. I learned a lot from you guys. I mean, I wouldn't have been able to cut the doors open on this if I didn't watch the videos and. And, uh, 
there's a lot of you guys that I've kind of learned some stuff from. Um, YouTube is pretty pretty good for that. Maybe next next video I shoot, maybe I'll take you guys into my garage like I said I was going to do, and I'll show you. I've got a 64 Falcon out there and a 62 pickup. Um, three Harleys out there, and I that's my other hobby. Um, but I guess that's it for now. I mean, I, I really haven't got, really haven't uh, done too much on here. I should show you the way. Hold on, I'm gonna put this camera down just for a sec. This is the way it, I built the jams on here. Let's see if I can get some light in on there. And it's going to focus. It's the jams I built. For there, I just, I just wanted to set it in there and show you how it fit. It fits pretty good. It's a lot of work in there. I'm gonna get going for now. I'm gonna I'm gonna work on the Nomad a little bit today. Um, thanks for watching. Uh, appreciate the comments again. Like I said, um, I'll have another update in another day or two. All right, YouTube. Uh, bye for now, and thanks for watching. Bye.